And welcome back. Here's a look at our tower cam time lapse. Valley's live storm team Skycam Network shot in Fargo. Complete sunshine through the morning. And uh, the clouds are to the north of Fargo. And we're still seeing sunny skies as of right now. That will change as we go through the next few hours. Let's take a look at the current flooding scenario. We do have a flood warning now issued for the Red River at Fargo. It does begin on Saturday night. Now, uh, the it is expected to reach minor flood stage that is 18 feet by Sunday morning. Continue to rise uh, to 23 feet by Thursday morning and at 23 feet North Broadway Bridge flood. So that is the flood warning in effect beginning Saturday night for the Red River at Fargo. Also we have a flood warning for the Red River at Wapaton. Moderate flooding is forecasted in that area through the weekend. Also a flood warning in effect through Monday afternoon for uh, areas south of Barnesville into Wilkin County and most of Grant County for some uh, overland flooding and some roads underwater. Those are the warnings and here's where the watches are. We have a flood watch through tomorrow afternoon for uh, Stutzman, Lamore, and Dickey County. So current uh, temperatures look like this. We're at 36 in Fargo Valley City near 40 out toward Jamestown and Carrington and mid to upper 30s across most of Lakes Country and low Lower 30s into uh, northwestern Minnesota, but the northern valley out toward the Devil's Lake Basin into the mid to upper 30s right now. The wind has picked up from a southerly direction uh, at uh, 10 to 20 miles per hour. It's starting to flip around to more of a northwesterly direction as a front makes its way through. Complete sunshine in, our, in the southern half of the viewing area. More cloud cover uh, further north and some rain and snow showers are starting in the uh, far northern section of our viewing area. Some uh, snow showers in the New Folden area. Some rain showers. Halleck out toward Cavalier Langdon could be seeing some snow showers as of right now. Not a lot of moisture with it, but you could get wet, see some flakes uh, through the afternoon. High pressure working off to the east. We have that southerly flow but a front is almost making its way through and behind it cooler air and the front will be responsible for giving us that moisture that will make its way through going through the uh, late afternoon with a slight chance of some rain or snow showers. Uh, temperatures on their way up. We should be into the upper 30s and lower 40s today across most of the region. Now the wind will pick up. Uh, breezy to windy conditions this evening and overnight uh, in the wind flipping around to a north or northwesterly direction. Temperatures on their way down into the low to mid 20s and the wind chill will feel much worse for this evening. And uh, low temperatures mainly into the low to mid teens to start off your Saturday morning. Temperatures not really going anywhere on Saturday. Upper 20s and lower 30s. Plenty of sunshine though. The winds will die down by the morning but uh, it will be pretty cold for this time of year. Recapping today's forecast, into the lower 40s uh, in Fargo, we will keep sunshine until uh, an increase in the clouds later on this evening. Possible rain showers and the wind flips around to the north becomes breezy to windy through the overnight. Only at 31 for Saturday, plenty of sunshine through Sunday, high of 35 and near 40 on Monday with sunny skies lasting through Tuesday with a high of 42. And now we have a chance of some uh, rain or snow showers Wednesday into Thursday, but temperatures falling from the mid 40s on Wednesday to the mid 30s on Thursday. But luckily it looks like those chances are pretty low right now. I mean, we got 20% and 40%. So. Right now we don't see a lot of moisture for next week. We'll let you know if that does change. Sounds good. Thank you, Justin. Mm -hmm.